hurting me. How could I ever think of hurting you? You know I won't. All I need from you is just your cooperation. If you cooperate with me, no problem. It took me two good months to beg you for this. You refuse. You are a wicked friend. I have money, please. <laughs> See who is talking about money? Money, you know I have excess. And no of it in my pocket, in my account. So let me come check if you're okay. So do you think I'm okay now? Of course. You look amazingly beautiful. Um, she 
Supposed to be a welcome from a wife to be. Ah, uh, sorry, ma. <laughs> That's <I> better. <laughs> Sit down, my dear. Thank you, ma. <laughs> Mama, how's your business? I thank God, my dear. <laughs> thank God for you too. Thank you. Okay, man. Yes, Mama. Please could you check the freezer? Get something for you. Uh, Okay. Mama, don't worry. I'm okay. I'm okay. Don't worry. No, no, no. Mama, I'm okay. If I insist. No, Mama, I'm okay. I'm just okay. Um, actually, Mama. Yes, dear. Uh, please, I'm sorry. The way things are. My sincere apologies. I didn't mean to take advantage of your daughter. My family and I will actually come for our marriage right. Please do that soon. Okay, Do that very soon. Okay. Time is not on our side. Yes, I want you to do it before people will start to notice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Sorry. I'm happy. Thank you. I'm happy. Yeah. Hopefully you won't disappoint me. <laughs> no, mama, I can't do that. Okay. I have a meeting to attend, George. Okay. So let me plan to fix myself. Okay, ma'am. I'm almost late. Okay, ma'am. Take care. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you very much. Nothing yet. Okay. Um, have you tried calling his friend Ethiopian? I, I, I tried, but I couldn't reach him on the phone. Should have at least one of his family members phone number. I can't believe I'm this dumb. This has nothing to do with you being dumb. That usually happens, especially. Did you meet him through any of his family members? Okay? So stop crying. Stop crying. I'm sure George is fine wherever he is. I think he is. Okay, man. You're my friend. And the only I of your mother. What is it my address right now? What is it? This pregnancy is yet to be noticed. And George is nowhere to be found. We're not even sure he's coming back. You can even stay at my place if you want to. All you need to do is say yes, and I'll take you to the best there is. And the rest will be history. I understand. Say yes, your place, history. What what are you talking about? Abort this child and continue with your life. Oh, George is nowhere to be found. 
Are you still my friend? Even my baby seems to be angry. I'm sorry, Ricky. I'm, I'm really sorry. I mean no harm. That, that was only a suggestion. What stupid suggestion? I need this baby so badly and I could feel it wanting me back. I don't care if Josh is here or not. But one thing is certain. My child has the right to live. And as a mother, I will ensure she has that. So, if you are not comfortable with this, then you get out of my life and shut my door. I was uh, yes dropping when you were talking with your friend. Mm. This is the second time you've proven yourself beyond my imagination that you are ready for motherhood, with or without a man. Okay. Women are many, but mothers are few. I celebrate you. Thank you, Don't think about taking care. I am here for you. I'll okay. fix it up. Mm. Mm. Thank you. That's why I love you. <laughs> but you know you are my world. Mm -hmm. I can never and I will never allow you to crumble. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, nice. I have a catering contract with Vain Construction Nigeria. <laughs> and I need you to handle it. Okay. So you can make some money for yourself. Are you Get rid of oh, this is beautiful. I think I can make money, take care of myself and my baby. Oh, that's mm. what I mean. How long is it going to last? Two years contract. Two and you're going years. to start next week. Oh, this has come at the right time. Mm. It has come. I know you will time. need more hands, okay. but you can fix that up yourself. Mm. And wherever you need me, you let me know. Okay, I'll do just that. Oh my God, that's right. Until then, you never really missed you. So you finally decided to come back. Stop, Auntie. How will you say that? You're making it sound like I've been gone for years. It's just been six months. My dear, you know I'm not used to missing you all that. I know, I know. How was the trip and the family? Fine, everybody's fine. I hope you brought something good for me. Auntie, how will you say that? You mean I'll travel that far and that long and not bring something back to my second mother? Oh, and then though, everything is packed inside don't be offended. me. I know. And I trust you did. Sure, I did. Mm. Uh -huh, Auntie. How is Ukeme? And how is she coping with her pregnancy? Have you guys finally heard from her? We've not heard anything from her. And we cannot even trace him. The right thank God that we cannot my daughter is happy. Mm -hmm. We've not heard from her. We've not. We need to seriously listen to our young girls. To abstain from sex before marriage. Ah, this is bad. I know this is wrong. But the plan is well. Only the unforeseen will okay. But we cannot, your cousin is better than that. Ukeme, my daughter, is well cultured. Auntie, I know. I know that Ukeme is well cultured. But who cares to see it that way? Who? Especially now that she's been put in the family way. Auntie, this is, it's bad, it's bad. We just have to encourage her to mm. face motherhood. That's just and I can't go to that. I'll stop by the house this weekend. 
You sure you're good with this? Yes. Or you need something? No, 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 no. Okay. We have an emergency that just came in. And I, I expect each and every one of you to please give me your very best. Remember the last company we work with? I mean, being construction. So this time is three years. So what that means is we give them nothing but the best. So before the end of the day, I will give you a wish out. Um, excuse me. Good afternoon, Mr. Tope. Oh, I'm sorry about that. They, they left um, 45 minutes ago. Okay. Please, can I call you back in the next few minutes? All right, thank you. Yes, I'm still here. I'm here. Oh, thank you. All right, then. Thank you very much. to be a very strong, determined, and resilient person. You need to do yourself a favor. Ignore your present condition before people will notice how unhappy you have become. Okay? You have your mom. She cares about you. You have me. You have your unborn baby. And even judge. Don't even mention that name here. Dad! Josh doesn't care. Josh is doing this just to hurt me. My pride is gone. But I'll prove him wrong. I will survive this heat. I will survive it. Exactly my point. There you go, girl. Come, sit down. Now, you know what? You need to take off that look from your face. Let people see the happy, Warm and sweet to come here again. Okay? You'll be fine. Sure, girl. You'll be fine. Okay? Oh. <laughs> Alright. I'm changing. I have burger. I have snacks. Anything? <laughs> no way. Who does snacks at this time of the day? I need real food. Hmm. Come on. <laughs> um, Ekman Kuko. To the kitchen, then. <laughs> so, girl. Good morning, my child. Hmm? How was your night? You know you are far gone. I'll supervise them today. Oh, thank you, Mommy. I really 
I appreciate your moment, Ken. Is it okay, my child? Mm. I think you are due for a visit to the clinic. Shay? Yes. I need to. Um, I'm beginning to feel stress already. <laughs> it's not your right. It's not your right. <laughs> Big sister. I'm guessing. Good morning, sister. Yeah, I woke up strong this morning. Okay. Yes, sis, I'll do just that. Okay, bye. Uh, sister Anderson, she won't need to visit her. Who knows? She might have another surprise for me. <laughs> Fine, bye. Get up, fix yourself up. Join me in the dining room. Okay, mom. I'll do just that. Alright. <sighs> oh, you go. What is this? You know the tire. I'm not picking myself for this place. So it's not like work. Hmm. I could have been reported for loitering around during work hours. <laughs> wow, you go. It's not a life with big grandma. Small play now, I don't play with you. You want good reports, make it, madam. But you know, say so you no good for the condition where she did now. You know that one. What condition are you talking about? Uh, what condition are you talking about? Hmm. You know, get I. Don't be, don't be me, you did this place. You know, say, madam, carry belly for our mama house. You know, see. How is that your business? Hmm. Can't you hmm. see the ring on her finger? It's everything. See that ring? Now, proper life. The man don't take up. But I don't fuck up. Oh. She don't fuck up big time. Hey. Mm -hmm. You have a point there. Oh. Mm -hmm. But why would a man do such a thing? Now me they ask. Go ask her mama where be the corners for church. Just have pity for her. She's a nice person. You fuck her. <laughs> I'm not talking anything. More. Join in so. I'm not talking. See, I'm not talking anything. More. As I did so, sleep day my eye. Have you with that grandma in your waist talk saying, if you go sleep early, go wake up early. <laughs> that grandma, they sit with that. <laughs> I thought you know it all. Dumb head. Eh? You say anything? You say anything? No, no, no. Come back, come talk. Don't worry. No wahala. She be at the dumb head. We go see. Please do your best. No, just give me any useful information. I will help relax my nerves. Thank you very much. Do have a nice day. Who was that? A call from the state CID. Any useful information? I'm afraid not. Oh, so sad. Well, I know you must be hungry. Let me get you something to eat. Do we have food? Of course, yes. I preserve some for you. I think I prefer that. Okay. Let's ah. go.
Ogeme? Yes, Mama. Are you all right? Oh, yes, Mama. But I thought I heard you talking with somebody. Ah. Ah. Okay, then. I'll be in my room. Okay, Mama. Take care. Okay, Mama. <laughs> My dear, even the most loving husband cannot do it for his wife. So, allow me to bear my cross. Hmm? <laughs> See who I repeat you. I do cross. Enjoy your cross. I didn't bring this for you. I didn't bring it. Mm. And, and I beg no children to give me dirty water. And forgive me for all those things we have in the tongue. So we meet Bintri tongue those things. So now my village people there and be. And you see, for my village, nobody like me. But if they don't like me, I see they surprise. I see a face. I see I don't change hundred percent. I don't. Why don't you keep quiet and leave this place right now? How could you be going to talk rubbish about your boss? Okay, me. Okay, me. How? Just let her. How? Please relax. Any other advice? I have nothing against you. You're good at your work and you do it very well. You think I'm going to talk here? Yeah. Oh, no, I won't do that. I won't do that. Auntie, mm -hmm. I see make you forgive me for those that we talk. And if it's please go. I forgive you. Just go and work. Go and do your work. I think we better first. I think I'll talk to you. I'll leave this place. I'm going to make you. You're going for insolent. So cheap. Insolent. What would Jesus do? And your Jesus. Oh, Mama, is everything all right? What is all right? What is all right? Shame on you, woman. You stay under my roof and got pregnant. And you cannot find the man that got you pregnant. Is that all right? You make me a subject of caricature among my women fold. Even your workers make jest of me. All because of your carelessness. And you are sitting down here asking me, is it all right? What makes it all right? How many things are all right? I'm sorry. No, 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 no. You are not sorry. You are not sorry. If you want to be sorry, get up there, go and look for the man that got you pregnant. Let him come and clean his mess. Do it for yourself and do it to save my face.
way. Why are you crying? It's Mama. <laughs> what happened to Mama? Yeah, suddenly changed. House is no longer conducive. Okay, man, forget about Mama. Eh? It might just be stress. Stop, please. Can I stay for a while? Listen, this is your house. You can stay as long as you want, okay? Okay? Just stop crying. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Have you had something to eat? Come on, let's get you something to eat. Come on, stop crying. Easy there. Okay. Sorry. Don't worry about Mama. I think Mama is aged. Sorry. Hello, Lizzie. Morning. Ah, my sister's slave. Home wasn't interesting anymore, so I needed a change of environment. Thanks for your concern. How is it going over there? Mm. Yes, I will. Okay. All right. Who was that? Um, it's my friend Lizzie. She calls from Lagos. Okay. Your mother has been calling, and you are not picking her calls. Why? <sighs> you don't have an excuse, right? Except that she flirted. On. You okay. Two wrongs can never make a right. Family is all you've got. Don't forget you have just one mother. And there can never be a place like home. Okay? Oh, excuse me. Let me get this. to worry about the doctor. Yes, I've got a good one. And we're visiting him tomorrow. You have to trust. Okay, man. You're not asleep yet. No, not yet. This time, not yet. Sister, you're back already. Yes, I just walked in. Okay. How are you? I'm okay. I came to take water. Okay. All right. Alright, sleep well, my dear. Mm, okay. Alright. Mm. Good morning, Mama. Good morning. Yes, ma'am. Good morning. Menu for today. She could maybe don't give us what we go to today for the menu, ma. Oh, she did? Yes, ma'am. Oh, thanks goodness. I hope you have the menu for the whole week, not just the not only for today, from tomorrow they go and I probably go to Forgive my ignorance, my dear. Okay. Problem. When we are done, let me know. Okay. Ma. Success. Thank you, ma. Thank you. Poor woman. She already missing her daughter. They tell you, they show for all her face. Yeah, they miss her too. Welcome, my children. Thank you, ma. Okay, man. I'm sorry if you wanted me to say so. The stress was too much on me. Hmm? You know, as a senior deaconess in the church, a community leader, the whole women were making jest of me. Even your workers, I was subject to a, a symbol of caricature. What do I say? Should I say I'm sorry? Hmm? Why 
Come on, give me a smile. Come on, smile. <laughs> I'm okay. Mm, it's okay, ma. It's all right. We don't have any issues here. Mm, Bex, I really think the change of environment will do Kemi a lot of good. Don't you think so? I want her to stay with me for a while. Is that still necessary? Yes, I think it would do her a lot of good. Okay, may you agree to that? It's okay. I'm okay too. All right, thank you, Ma. Thank you very much. Let me check something in the kitchen. Stay with me for some time. You're happy now. Mm -hmm. All right. Tired of here. <laughs> All right, baby. Let me do this too much. Okay. All right. Um, excuse me. Is that my phone? I don't think it is here. Whoa, that's very serious. What? Why the sudden change from her? I'm worried about those private calls. I don't know how to be such a secretive person. You know, we've always lived like family, and now she's completely something else. So, um, what happened at the hospital? I didn't go. I excused myself out. <laughs> that was really smart of you. Um, you know what? Enough of this. I'll be back home tomorrow, okay? Oh, thank God. Thank God. I, I, I need someone to talk to in time like this. Where are you? That place sounds somehow. Just shut up. Why do you keep embarrassing me every time? Um, I didn't do the usual at home this morning, so... I hurriedly came to work. Um, I'm in the toilet. <laughs> ah, no wonder this place thinks. <laughs> Silly you. Greetings, Mama. Good day, my dear. Miss Anderson. Lizzie. Lucy. I want to thank God first for keeping everybody safe and healthy, especially my fiancé. I never run away from my responsibilities. 
Please hear me out. The truth on this was when I traveled to see my parents. I was arrested by drug enforcement on the ground that I am a drug dealer. When me and my friend drove down the checkpoint, a vehicle was stopped, our luggages were searched. How the substance got into my box was beyond my explanation. I was arrested and detained for further investigation. I couldn't tell UK because I knew that would traumatize her with her condition. Mm. I only informed my family and Mrs. Anderson. Cousin to know a few days ago when UK came to spend some time with her. And you think that was the right thing to do? <gasps> you have at least notified me. I would have been as fine. <laughs> I'm sorry, my love. I pleaded with Mrs. Anderson. Remember to tell anyone, even mm. you, my love. Because of your condition. After some time, in detention, God Almighty came to my rescue. When the notorious gang were arrested, in their confession, they mentioned Barrister. Sylvester Bakari has been their sponsor and they are the same people that put cocaine inside my box. Mm -hmm. He also called drug enforcement to arrest me and my friend Eto so he can win the court case he had in favor of his client. That is how I was released some weeks ago. Barrister Sylvester Bakker will be captured as well as to pay me for defamation and damages he caused me this month. Did you say Sylvester Bakari? Yes. <laughs> okay, could you be saying Sly Baka? Is everything all right? Dark skin. Mm -hmm. Very shy. Yes. He has this this reddish overflow in his eyeball. Something, something like that. Do you know him? Ah. 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 He's the closest to me. He's got his. That bastard. Yes, mom. That same man. No, this time it's not going to be easy with him. No, no, I said no. No, no, no. Do you mean Barrister Sylvester Bakary is the rapist yes. you told me about? Yes, baby. Oh. Oh. Deaconess Usen. Yes, Pastor. I have not been seeing you in church. What seems to be the problem? It's about your daughter, isn't it? Yes, Pastor. Let me ask you a question. Is it better? To please God, or is it better to please a man? First thing, you know I trained my daughter very well, and she's well cultured. Well, what has happened? I cannot explain. What happened is not your fault. Abortion is an abomination before God. And even before man. Deaconess Usain, you are among the best mothers. 
that we have in church and even in our society and your impudence can never be forgotten in a hurry so relax the young man in question is he a believer pastor he is he's a believer very well then is he ready to marry ukeme pastor he's very much ready then the church will wait there but only when the child is born thank you very much pastor I need them to come and see me. Stella. Yes, Pastor. Uh, during the week, when am I free? On Wednesday in the morning from 7 to 10. And on Friday in the evening from 4 to 6. Please, let them come. I'll pass the information to them. Thank you, Pastor. Pastor, thank you very much. It's okay. At least you are coming as elevated my spirit once more. We have overcome. That's it. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you. Let's go. Mom, we're looking forward to seeing you this Sunday. Okay. We've we'll really missed you. I'll try. Thank you. All right, Mom. Bye bye. Thank you. Make sure Mama get all that she want. I don't want her leaving Lily's side for once. Is that okay? Yes, Mama. Take care of the house. All right, Mama. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs> That's a good news. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Baby. Yes, darling. Barista Sylvester Bakari has been captured. Ah. <laughs> That's good. Just is at last. <laughs> you can say that again. Yeah. Hoping let's go. Yes. Motherhood is all embracing. Motherhood is not just buying clothes. Motherhood is not just um, cooking for your children, making sure they are fed well. It's not just about paying school fees or helping to pay school fees. All those, all those things are important. They are important. But the most important is bringing up your children to be useful citizens of the country where they live in, wherever they live in. It's bringing them up with the fear of the Lord. As a mother, you become a carpenter, you become a hairdresser, you become a friend, you are an enemy, you are everything. To be a true mother, you have to be everything to your children. Motherhood, when I say enemy, because you have to discipline, and we know no child actually loves being disciplined. It's been interesting. Being a mother, and a walker. Um, shuttling between the two can be very, very um, tasking. But um, all in all, nothing beats motherhood.
in my days, I think it was a little better being a mother because the children were not as inquisitive and as knowledgeable as they are now. The challenges are there and um, for every woman, what you need to do mostly is understudy your child and try to be a step ahead of the child. It's not easy to be a parent. I always see parenting as a responsibility. And so you have to be a role model. For you to succeed as a parent, you have to show them the good example. The Bible says, train a child in the way you should go, and it will not depart from it. Being a woman is a great responsibility, and women are the pillars of this generation and the generation to come. If you exclude women from whatsoever thing that you are doing, automatically the world will be null and void. I passed through a lot of hardship, played the role of father and mother. I sent my children to school. Today, my children have made me become a fine mama. They don't want to marry person when they get something. They want the one where get more do. They get a house. They want ready made food. They don't want to suffer. So those were one that thing where they do things before they go in there. When they go mad, they don't go last. If you read the Bible, if you read the book of uh, Proverbs 31 from verse 10, you see that woman. The Bible says she, she does everything. She even considers the poor as a gift to them. So she does everything. She's a mother, she's a worker, she's a don't ever give up. Whatever you want to do, go for it. You want to be a fashion designer, go for it. Whatever, whatever you desire, a position of presidency, go for it. And with the help of God, I mean, you, you can make it. That's what happened to me. I did not give up. Mama, mama, eh. Bye.